I'm Jeff Parker. I'm the Culinary Director for Bull Outdoor Products. I'm pretty excited about today's topic. We are going to learn how to build a fire in our new Bull Outdoor Pizza Oven. So the first thing we want to do is check to see what we need, and we're going to start with the fire starters. The most important thing to remember when selecting a fire starter is that they are non-toxic. Stay away from anything that is compressed sawdust and paraffin. These little deals burn really quickly, they light very easily, and they're not going to put off any kind of odor or any kind of chemical into your oven. They're available at pretty much any hardware store or even online. So after the fire starter, we want to talk about kindling because we want something that's going to burn fairly easily. The kindling is going to help the fire catch so we can start feeding it with some bigger pieces of wood. You want a few pieces of dried hardwood, such as oak, no longer than three or four inches wide and about 18 to 20 inches long. All right, so let's build a fire. We're going to start by removing the door. And with your oven comes a stainless steel wood caddy that Bull provides. It's awesome because what you're going to do is you can set it right off the center. And then once your fire has died down, you're just going to sweep the whole thing over and it's going to help you move your coals over to kind of ease the process. So next I like to take a few just smaller wood chunks and lay those across the caddy. And then I've got uh, four pieces of kindling here. Three or four pieces will do. You just build yourself like a little campfire. And you're gonna take two or three of these little fire starters and just nestle them in underneath the kindling. Grab your lighter. Light the wood starters. And there you have it. In about five minutes, that kindling's all gonna catch. Everything's gonna be great. And then we'll start stoking the fire. So our kindling is caught. So I'm just gonna take oh, four pieces of wood. And again, this is hardwood that is dried and they are three to four inches wide and about 18 inches long. I'm just gonna stack those on top of the kindling that's lit. And that should catch in a second and we'll be good to go.